declarator pipeline to deploy the PIN server and Ansible to configure Tomcat. So, and uh, again, next thing I have to. It is kind of the task itself. Okay. Uh, Anil, can you share the things I'll try to invite? Mails thing, a mails. So, have not got the things, they can just join from the chat. I'm not getting anyone name actually. I think so. They might have not clicked on the link, they might have not registered. How many of you registered, guys? Four members should appear here. How many of you registered? Uh, uh, I didn't add them that one, so. Okay, uh, just search for uh, Rakesh. Rakesh name is there. Ashwini name is there. Again, another. Ashwini name, I'm getting. Uh, Uma, try search for Uma. No, no one has registered in my. Okay, copy the invitation and send them. Through Slack, you can send directly, Shankar. So many are there. It is in the chat for me. I want to start AKC. Uh, it's me. Yeah. And still. Still mail ID session is that Rakesh dot double six seven. Rakesh dot Rakesh or uh. dot dot is not there. Double six seven three. Double six seven three. Got the invite. One more mail ID I added, Shankar. Uma yesterday gave me mail ID. You can just add that one also. In chat, I have cared. Shankar, your voice is in mute, I think. I'm not talking. Everyone, please, uh, if you have received the link, you click on the link and register. Just basic details, it will ask, like, uh, which type of company you are working, uh, what are the, uh, like, what are the uh, places where you are working, like, what kind of support you are providing. So, just feel that basic detail, so you your email ID will get updated here.
Me, you did not got anything. Everyone registered, guys. Registration completed. Vinay, Anil, Ashwini, Rakesh, Uma. have compliant access to the match link. all of these things and then the server. Still only Ashwini's name is there. What about others, member? Yeah, Rakesh. So after completing this, you should tell me okay, the comments if you are facing any issues and this should be moved to in progress yes. okay if you start working you should move this like you can drag and drop okay once you start working and pending and once it is done you should do okay while once it is done pending okay you can move to the done state and you should tell so we will try to ask on daily note what you have done is this ticket is completed or not so now checking this creating this script to check out and github code and generate the artifact and even this particular infra should be done via ansible installing ansible via In, installing server via ansible yeah, installing Ansible and configuring. Okay. Configuring. And Rakesh and Rishna have told uh, installing of property, and this is not a problem, but installing the prompt and which else? Okay, and this shell script should be.
I mean to say, I told already to install. Uh, to install for the Tomcat. And the only condition that I told is not to, uh, I mean, you can skip. It should work with respect to your OS model. So, CAT, ETC, and uh, OS release, you can skip. And assume that you have Red Hat or directly or anything and just try to install the things. Okay. And installing as well, you should use the variables concept. Okay like URLs or whatever it might be. And that should be specified. All these URLs or some other thing should be specified in some file. Okay. Specified in some file. And you should source that file. I mean, you try to do these kind of thing. Win slash slash. Okay. And uh, after that, you'll try to write some, all the things. So here you'll try to use some of the commands. And this particular line will take input from that particular other file. Okay. Or else you can directly as of now as a parameters like uh, you are uh, like I just don't want to hard code it. Just try to complete on a manual note. Okay. Um, and you can try this in the other parts. And while you are giving the interviews, you should say I have involved, I have been involved in converting many of the shell scripts to Ansible playbooks. Okay, so this can be, so how many tickets were there? Architecture design, this was done. This was, uh, this was assigned to, let us say, okay. Architecture design we have already done. One is where or one deleted or one. Okay, so you can move the things assigning. Due date and its due date will be the same thing. Deploy and deploy. You can clap and do it. Start it. Nothing is there. Let me delete it. Priority. Everything is high priority. A day will be given mostly. Okay, so do one L command and spelling answer the mark and try this. Package can try this. And when I have nothing, okay, creating. And documents, all of the documents should be done by when I do. So all the things, uh, when I, I hope you have the access for conference. If not, once again, I'll try to see. Okay, some of, for some of the people I had given only Jira. So all the things, how we have configured, what is the thing, everything you should write in this particular uh, new winner dot. Yeah, everything you should do here in from monitoring or something, whatever it might be. So end to end, you should start, you, you should create it, you should page, you should, it can be blog or something. And with IP address as well, even if you try to stop that, if it is against, 
please try to start practicing stopping it rather than deleting. Okay. Anyway, it is only for volume artist and it will be very minimal. It, it won't cost you like even till completion of a month, it won't uh, cost you more than uh, two days of money. Okay. So you try to document even IPs, what is Jenkins server, everything should be cleared on a specific, and if anyone tries to read it, uh, he should be able to understand. Let me delete this. So one task I'll do. And all of the people should all they do, uh, they should do other tasks as well. This is this was done actually. Let me move this. It is not required installing because anyway, Tom said that for given right. So start it, set in and due date is you should specify this as well. Okay. Where is the day? Due date is 13. Yeah, 13 itself. And if you are unable to do, you can comment it. Right after other issue. Okay, start it and move it. I guess all the things will be visible and if it is not assigned. Go to this service and apply everyone. Let us apply this per month. Because this is already done, you told them that, that is the reason. Can you open the status and do it? It is done, ma'am. Architecture will. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Uh, you have deleted something now. So the uh, assigned task is visible to you, not all. Okay. So try to do all the tasks should be done by everyone, actually. And there is no time. It will be visible to other Shankar. It won't be visible. Yeah, yeah it is. Will It will not be visible. But you can copy it or do something uh, so that because this assign... at least they should uh, you can understand who have done what. Okay, if this particular person is doing so and so, Mama Heshari is deploying the thing. So you should ask her what she is doing at least. Okay, so that you'll because you all people should know each and everything actually. 
So in in work like whenever you are trying to work, Vinay, Ashwini, and Uma will be in one shift. So from one to ten or something in USA timing, and these three people will be in other thing. Okay. So whenever uh, like alerts will be coming, so they will be responsible for the tickets. So you can't say I know this particular ticket itself, and whenever he is there in the shift, I'll try to resolve. This kind of things will not be possible. Okay, so try to exchange all of the things. Everyone should have all of the idea what the other person is doing, and everyone should complete all of this task end to end. And mean even this along with this, you should complete the Docker things as well, Docker videos which we had shared. Okay. Migration project is there, right? Uh, migration that I have told, which we will try to create. It will take some time. You can take uh, to Friday. Friday, two days. Or if it is very new, you can submit it on it. Okay. And everyone should be uh, reporting to NAP. And uh, once you are done, you just try to move it. Okay. Board you will be getting. And uh, yeah, here you can change the thing to or in progress we start it and move it and whoever is the reporter you should come and do the thing okay fine guys uh, hope you have complete the things yesterday right all of the things everyone everyone I'm asking everyone have you completed all of the things Okay, so we should increase the base for them. So everyone has come and have the things. Please be on mute and reduce your volume. Do you have any doubts? Am I audible, guys? Yes. So you should complete and we'll be there to assist you whenever you got factor. So if you have any of your issues that you cannot do, you can share your screen and let us know. Yeah. Are there any issues or bloggers? So can everyone tell me the status what you had worked yesterday and what you are going to do for today? You can start actually. Am I audible, guys? Yes, yes, you are audible. Yeah, please you, see you it is yourself and start speaking. Okay, whenever in office, if they, if they ask, you should not be in silent, you should unmute and talk some more. That hey, yeah, you should tell, yeah, yeah, I'm working on this. This at least you should say, yeah, yeah, at least <laughs> meeting. Okay, so unmute yourself and talk what you have worked yesterday and share your uh, you should not share, but yeah, you should tell the status what you had worked yesterday. So actually, yesterday, ma'am uh, provided a URL. So she asked us to clone into local repo. Hello? Yeah, yeah, you are audible. 
and she asked us to do maven compile package and then she asked us to push that uh, clone file into my remote repo so we have done that task remote repo you have done man yeah yeah, yeah. I asked them to create their own repository at a remote location and push their code. Okay, okay. Have you completed that task? Yes, okay, what is the today task for you? You can log in to Jira and you can check out guys. No one is in online. Everyone is offline. Everyone, please log in to Jira. Check your work. Check the issue assigned to you. And if task is completed, you can move the status to done. You can change the status. Vinay, Anil, Ashwini, Uma, please, please log in to Jira. Yeah, Kalani. I have assigned two tasks: uh, one migrating server and uh, one NFS uh, task. So I will let you know the update as soon as possible. Very good, very good. Yeah, good to know. And have you completed yesterday's task? Actually, uh, I am in Delhi yesterday, so actually the task is done before only. Uh, okay, but okay. yeah, correct. I will do that today also, and let you know that that one also. Correct, correct. Fine, good. Will you can tell for other people as well how you had configured that all of them. Yeah, sure. Uh, I will create POCs and uh, I will share them them all. Anyone can interact in Slack actually. Okay. In group call you can make. Mm -hmm. sure. Okay. Everyone can share their screen. So directly whenever you want, you all can connect uh, in the Slack channels in group meeting and uh, it is kind of a Zoom itself or everyone is allowed to share the screen or every option you will be getting and there you can discuss but recording will not be there for that yeah sure yeah that's all that's all from my side yeah uh, Vinay have you completed the task which is uh, like try to understand like it is not for only one individual all the task everyone should complete complete day is there right What is the status of you, Vinay? Are you there? Yeah, Shankar. I was completed with the task. Uh, okay. I just want to clean the mail. Okay, okay. So you have completed yesterday all of the tasks which was assigned to you. Yeah. Your, you have pulled all of your artifact to local. So, um, so do you have any issues for that? I mean, any any block, any bottlenecks for everyone? Is there any issues to complete that task? No. No, no any issues. That's okay. really good. So, you have completed, right? My as well. Yeah. Uma, I am asking you itself. Ah, uh, yes, sir. No doubt, sir. I have completed, sir. You have completed, or you have to complete it? I have to complete it, sir. But I understood. I'll complete it by today, sir. Okay. Fine. No yesterday is one which is pending your delay. Yesterday one or today one. Yesterday when you had completed, right? Okay, okay, fine, fine. We, whatever, like, uh, which are assigned, you try to complete and let us know if we have any block. Fine, yes. And you all can communicate with each other. And if needed, you can call to me or ma'am on Slack, on an official note. Okay? On Teams as well, I'll try to 
it's, yeah it's... i want to add one more thing shankar along with this what the exact task everyone have to do these are the individual tasks assigned to you along with this one more task you have to do that is related to your project so you need to write the pipeline uh, script in jenkins that pipeline script perform two tasks uh, mainly uh, so first task uh, first stage in that script is that pull the code from your own repository or let me share something uh, can you stop sharing shankar so that i can share I hope my screen is visible to everyone. So this is the architecture diagram for your project. So up till now, what we have done, we have uh, created our GitHub repository. Everyone is now ready with their GitHub repository. Everyone have the source code and uh, everyone uh, have their own GitHub repository. Now, next thing what we have to do, you need to start the Jenkins server. You need to create one Jenkins server and you need to configure Jenkins server with Git and Maven. Okay. Git Maven, uh, you need to configure in this Jenkins server and you need to pull the code from GitHub repository and you need to build the artifact through your Jenkins pipeline script. Okay, I think so this task is specially assigned for one or two person, but along with that, everyone should try these things. So in Jenkins, you have to write the pipeline script. That pipeline script will pull the code from GitHub repository. You just write down somewhere, guys. And second, uh, you need to generate an uh, artifact or you need to build that project. And third task, you need to deploy that project on the Tomcat server. So here you have to start your Tomcat server through Ansible configuration. And you need to deploy var file or jar file, whatever artifact generated. That artifact you need to deploy on the Tomcat server. Okay. So what things you need to do? Let me write down here. Yeah, Kalyan, come uh, once, come again once, please. Yeah, let me write down here. So, what things you need to do today? You need to check out code. You need to write pipeline script. So, you can use declarative pipeline, okay? There, we have two types of pipeline, am I right? Yeah. Declarative yes. and script. So, just go with the declarative. Declarative pipeline. Okay. And uh, with the declarative pipeline, the first stage should be, you need to write the stages. In that first stage should be check out code. Check out code from GitHub. That is first task. Second, second stage will be build your project. Build your project. Third, deploy your application on Tomcat server. Now here, two things are there. Either you can create Tomcat server manually. server manually or via Ansible. That is up to you. Okay. Now here, uh, which plugin will be used to deploy artifact on the Tomcat server? We have an inbuilt plugin in uh, Jenkins. Yes. Which plugin? Sorry, pardon me. Deploy war here to a container. Deploy what to deploy uh, deploy to container. Yes. The plugin which we have to use is deploy to container. And rest of the things you need to do the configuration. Like uh, if you want to use Git in your Jenkins, you need to uh, install Git. Install Git and to build project, which software we require? Maven. So, install Maven. And Maven is based on which language? Java. Java. So configure Maven and Java. So this configuration you need to do. Again, to deploy your application on the Tomcat server, what we need to do? We need to configure 
Tomcat server. Am I right? Which configuration we need to do in a Tomcat server? Which file we need to? Correct. Tomcat user dot XML. And while configuring this file, be just be careful. You need to add one important thing. Like every time you are adding admin GUI, manager GUI, along with that, add manager script. Otherwise, Tomcat server will give error for sure. Three things you need to add. Add admin GUI, manager GUI, and manager script. Otherwise, your Tomcat file will give error. Guys, remember, while configuring users in a Tomcat, three things we need to add when we are working with the Jenkins. Uh, admin GUI, manager GUI, and manager script. Okay? So, these are the configuration you need to do it here. So, this task is clear to everyone? Yeah. yeah. So, this is the task along with this. Uh, whatever task you are getting in Jira, that task also, that is individual task, everyone have to complete that individual task along with these things. Okay. Yeah. Any doubt in this, guys? So, uh, here, uh, you can configure Tomcat server via Ansible. So, you need to write the Ansible playbook and you need to configure Ansible in your Jenkins server if you want to trigger that playbook. I, I I will assume that everyone knows that steps, like how we can configure Ansible in a Jenkins server and how we can trigger the script, uh, how we can uh, trigger the playbook, Ansible playbook. So you can uh, just check out the steps and just try to complete this task. Clear to everyone? Yeah. Fine. And once the task is completed, just move the change the status, okay, from to do to make it as a completed pending or whatever it is. So we will follow some in a professional way, guys. Why we are making this all things, you know, you should get familiar with the actual real time scenario. So this is not for the temporary purpose or this is for not a namesake, guys. Uh, you know, people will join company, but they will not familiar with these these things like how to work with the Jira software, how to complete the task, how to assign the task. Mm -hmm. These things they they are not uh, they are not familiar with. And the main intention of uh, this. Please mute your topic. Please mute yourself, guys. Okay. So that's the reason we are making all this. Uh, we have we are using Jira software and we are uh, taking the project. We are assigning task. So only main intention is that you should get familiar with all this real time scenario. So I hope everyone is clear. So if you have any doubt, you can ask here, or else we will meet again in tomorrow session. And please try to join sharp eleven thirty guys. Every time yeah, yeah. meet. Okay. Start on the exact time. No one will wait for you. Be punctual and try to speak also. Because few students we have seen uh, that they they know technical skill. They are able to do the task, but they are they are not able to speak in a meetings or in a company. And because of that, many people got terminated. So you just speak, okay? No one is going to judge here, like what you are speaking, why you are speaking, or what uh, the whether the answer is correct or wrong. No one is going to judge here. So you just speak whatever things are there, whatever updates are there, you just try to give that updates. I hope I'm clear to everyone. And take this thing seriously, guys. Please. Let us know. But uh, before coming to us, I should see at least uh, that you had failed for 20 times or 30 times before reaching out to me. It could be anything. Okay. Even in office, something on uh, like people will not give you all of the tickets which you know itself. For sure, this will happen. So the adaptability or understanding all of the things, you should be very clear. And you should ask the people, you should interact how to do if you have bloggers and they'll guide you even in office. And uh, yeah, that's what I just want to address. And ma'am will be also helping you out not to the top notch level we will be as we'll be helping you out but before reaching us uh, you should we should see at least if it is jenkins build failures or or docker issues or terror
a form of shell scripting, all of the things. And all the things should be completed, guys. Okay. In organizations, even one day they can help you out. Okay. I have not, I'm doing in the things. Okay. If they will allow you, all the things for sure. And this NFS server as well. If you have done manually, try with Ansible. Okay. Try with Ansible of installing all of the Grafana, Prometheus, all of the things. And one more thing, ma'am, like you can go to the architecture. Just now we had scrolled, right? Yeah, this Jenkins server should come up via Terraform. Okay, Jenkins server should come via Terraform and the installations, I, I mean spinning up and installation of Jenkins, Maven and what are all the softwares which need to be installed on that particular Jenkins server should be done by Ansible. Am I clear on this? Yeah. Yeah. The Jenkins server with Terraform and I want Terraform via modules. Okay. So as of now, if it is okay, like spin up manually or something, at least via Terraform code. And soon it need to be converted via Terraform modules. And state file should be stored in S3. And all the Terraform files, all the things, whatever you try to do should be stored in GitHub. Okay on on like every commit should be there everyone and uh, yeah that's all any doubts go ahead or good to wind it up every day the scrum gets started at 11 30 to 12 or 12 15 thanks oh uh, yes Anka. we need to install everything right now or the grafana and everything or uh, we can just try, uh, just try it okay, okay. So all the things, this is just for practice kind of. Okay. Just try to water all the, let me share the screen. You can stop the screen, man. So the same thing, you can copy the Zoom one in Slack, you can post. Okay, I don't have Slack as well. So just try to install Prometheus, you know Prometheus, right? Installing all of the things, what are all the things and Grafana or something. I have told normally, you can give it a try, this will work. So first of all, what you will try to do is, generally you will try to download or you will try to go to etcm.report.d or something or double you get and the particular uh, package, I mean RPM or something, you will try to download, URL you will try to give you will try to go to temp or something and you will try to tar it or you will try to unzip it right and you will be getting all of the things binaries and inside your binaries you will try to have promise your yaml or x y z and you will try to run this particular script right so the same things you can define like directly all of the things post and uh, like the uh, what is that become yes task name installing like downloading or updating the thing and what is the module yeah and uh, state all the things whatever or state present or uh, like update or star you will try to give i did not remember exactly so here all the things, what are the arguments it is taking M module. You should go to the particular site and search. So if you try to see what arguments it is taking, you can see. And if it is required, if it is there, that you should pass for sure. If you try to see nothing is there here, true, something. Examples, you can watch example. Okay. And you can, you will feel like a get underscore URL is there. So here it will be required option. So this option you should pass, config file. That for sure you should pass here. Okay, two spaces you can give and you can tar it. And you, in order to download, what is the op module? You can directly search even in it. What is the module? which you will be using for download, which you will be using for WGAP. 
which is equal to w get get underscore url in ansible you can say and you can pass all of the things get underscore url and just try to search it and uh, go ahead okay try to do these things first try to complete all of the things which were given and rest you can try okay the equivalent module you will try to do it and service module system day module and just try to close the particular there is nothing fancy you can get the internet help anyhow yeah fine yes we'll try to meet tomorrow yes sir.